great people, great people of Biafra, my great people, freedom fighters, lovers of freedom, great people all over the world. I thank you all once again today. And I want you people to listen to this uh, message. It's going to be a quick one, very, very quick. And I want you all to pay very attentively and listen very careful. I want to, I am not coming here to analyze or to address anybody. The answer is no. But I want to talk about the visit of Soludo to our leader, Mazen Namdo Kukano. Of course, a lot of people have said uh, 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 what they think or what they thought about it. I have saw a lot of people are calling it Photoshop, a dictated picture, but that does not matter. I, the Bia franchise, the one she like Mazo Kichuku, the general. I am not coming here to support anybody, ladder condemning anybody. But I'm just want to point out some certain things that we're supposed to understand about this, our movement, our struggle to restore our motherland called Biaf. I want our people to know because you see, we have a lot of people that they were not there in 2016. They were not there in 2015. They are never be there because most of them that are causing confusion today, most of them that are brainwashing our people today, most of them that they are stolen from our people by defrauding our people because of Biafran restoration. They were not there. So they don't even understand what really happened. But I want our people to understand. You may say your opinion. You may say how you feel. But I something that I want to point out here. I don't care if Soludo visited our leader. But I issue. There is one particular thing that I want our people to understand. By visiting our leader. In 2016, Soludo leads and they visited our leader in Kuje prison. So when you are talking about Soludo visiting our leader on Friday, it's not a new thing. I'm just reminding those people so that you will understand. And who is Soludo? Soludo is a governor of Anambra State today. What I want you people to understand for our people to understand that Mazen Namdekano is, is not a terrorist. If the governor of a state from Anambra can go to DSS dungeon and visited our leader on Friday and seated and discussed with our leader, that means that Mazen Namdekano is not a terrorist. Now do you understand what I'm saying to my people? I know that people think that I'm coming here to begin to gossip. I don't say things that I don't know. I always stand straight. And whenever it come on my desk, I will say things the way it is. What I'm bringing out on that picture of visiting of our leader by Soludo, the governor of Anambra State, where I come from. That's to show that our leader Mazen Namdekano is far from terrorists. The group called IPOB, the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, led by Mazen Namdekano, are far from terrorists. Because I am telling you people, if you don't know, now begin to understand it. There is no place in the world and they will call you a terrorist and the sitting governor will go and visit you. It's impossible. That to show you that we are not terrorists. They are just trying to suppress us down. They are just trying to put fears 
in us so that we will begin to think otherwise that we cannot do this. But I'm urging all the great people of Biafra, caution yourself when you speak. I am not telling you what to say, but make sure you understand before you begin to say things that you don't understand. Take precaution, caution yourself, think twice, meditate before you begin to write your article or you begin to make your speech. But my own, what I want to let our people understand, that Mazen Namdekan is not a terrorist. That if Mazen Namdekan were a real terrorist, there is no how a governor of a state from that Nigeria will go and visit a terrorist in Kuje, or I mean in a DSS dungeon, and they went so far to take a picture. It can never happen. It can never happen. If Mazen Namdekan is a real terrorist, there is no how a sitting governor, there is no how they can be able to allow a sitting governor to enter into DSS and sat down with the leader of indigenous people of Biafra that some people are claiming that we are a terrorist. That is something that I want you people to understand on this today's broadcast. So we have to understand that we are not terrorists. Because if we are, there is no how a sitting governor, they can allow a sitting governor, there is no how they can allow the sitting governor to go to DSS and sit and discuss with somebody they claimed. That is why I'm trying to tell you people that we are not terrorists. The world never proscribed us. The Sukho Nigeria just trying to do, you know, mago mago. Uh, they just want to kind of appear in fear so that we go to talk, say, hey, this, you know, they don't proscribe us, so uh, we don't have right to talk, oh, and this and that. And, you know, all this kind of, uh, you know, concocted stories. We are not here. We are focusing. We are moving forward. And we are not going to stop. I don't care about what you people are talking about, Soludo. What I'm saying is particular on this visiting of Soludo to our leader. You people may say whatever you people want to say. But I am telling you people what I understand by Soludo taking picture with our leader and be able to post it on his page. Because when you go to Soludo page, you will see it. Prof. Charles Soludo, the governor of Anambra State today, when you go to his page, he published the picture that he took in DSS dungeon with the leader of indigenous people of Biafra, Mazen Nam de Okukano, the mouthpiece of Biafran people, the number one citizen of Africa, the mirror that Africa will use to see in future, and they have already started. Because everyone in Africa have already recognized the leader of indigenous people of Biafra. So what that means by Soludo taking picture with our leader, that shows that Mazen Namdekano and the people that he leads are not terrorists. This is what I want you people to know and put this inside your skull before you say things that you don't know. And we are moving forward. We are not going to stop. We don't care about who they are. We don't care if you go and visit our leader. We don't care if you did not. What we are saying that humanity must be free. Mazen Nam the canon have to be free. You people, those of you that gathered and sold him out an extraordinary rendition him to that zoo called Nigeria should go out there and bring him out so that he will, get, he will come out and rejoin his family. And we are moving forward. Biafra must come. Whether you like it or not, Biafra must come. All oh, hey Biafra. All oh, hey Biafra. All oh, hey every indigenous people of Biafra. Thank you, my people. Good day.